Kamusta? Hello once again. Kamusta guys? Kamusta mga tol? So guys, can you see this house behind me? So today I am going to show you my ancestral house. That is my, this is my great grand uh, father's house. And there is something very special going on in, inside this house. So before I go, I take you in, I want to quickly tell you a story why we have this kind of house. So this is the traditional house of Assam. The reason we have this Assam type house, if you look on the other side, it's the same there as well. It is called Assam type house because this area of India, the northeast area, is also under the tectonic plate. So we often have earthquakes. So based on that earthquake, our houses has to be good enough so that we don't die, right? So the typical Assamese house should be like this with smaller structures and tins not the building uh, you know concrete buildings you can still have now a lot of people have even the house behind is a duplex or triplex uh, house but the government gives you special permission on to having those houses based on how uh, what is your area and the, the earthquake zone and everything so this house is my great grandfather's house as I told you already but as of today or as of now nobody of my family stays here all of my family members they stay behind there are houses behind there so this house is being rented out to an NGO who promotes indigenous products from all over northeast so they promote and they um let me walk you through it they promote indigenous ooh, so beautiful um, things and products from different parts of northeast india so northeast india guys have seven states and today we are going to look into some of the handloom, handicraft and all the things that is very indigenous and local of the Northeast. So this is an NGO and they are running this uh, with you know all the products. So as soon as I enter, if you are, if, I, if I may go back, you can see this very cute looking tables. is a Nagaland shawl Nagamis shawl look at this let's go inside olives olives pickle again bamboo shit pickle maybe i will take one of this for gesture some lemon pickle sweet olive what else so yeah we've got so many pickles in here the first room when you enter this ngo they have put all the in indigenous products like pickles eateries you know small stuff like a bit of candies and you got um, turmeric powder so you got and then some sumac berry powder and cinnamon powder so they have put up some um, products that you can buy when you enter the first room and here is a lovely lady Hi. 
Okay, so a small correction. This is not an NGO, but a private owned, um, I think a business sector, something like that. And it's called Mati. Mati means soil. So they are doing things that is close to your soil, to your land, to your indigenous people. This one, guys, is used for rice. Natural beads, and I think they have—they are more from the Nagaland uh, state. And I don't know if there is also other mix, but they have very beautifully displayed everything here, and they also have the price tag. So this one, guys, it's really pretty. It's 1,800, which is not bad. So let's go inside. Or your curry or your dal, it's all it. You have your fork and let's eat. I'm already full, guys. Let's go to the next room. So, the next room here, ooh, wow, look at the contrast, guys. It's like so pretty. I love the color of rattan. So, this room is more on furniture and decorative items. So, you got this main. Um, furniture for your living room and then what else do you have so behind me you have all the traditionally woven shawls all the shawls are all remember this guys in one of my Naga video I had this 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 
is one of the handmade product of Nagaland. Very pretty, right? This is all indigenous things, clothes and everything that we wear in North East. wants a bag. This is so pretty and cute. This one is made of jute. I think it also comes from bamboo jute. And on top, they have decorated it so pretty, right? It's going to be really, really cute for the kids to have a bag like that for school. So yeah, we have a lot of things here. You have some cushion covers. Let me show you. Look at this cushion cover, so colorful, so pretty. And you got some mats. Oh, this is so pretty. You can put it under your drinks, like a coaster. And you got some boxes. You can use this as your jewelry box where you can put all your items. So, quite a lot of things actually to show you. Our very famous Assamese tool made of bamboo as well. Alright. And these, look at this. So this I think is when fishermen used to go for fish. Like in a bigger this used to be in a bigger size and you can put all your fish in it. But this one I think is more like a decorated grandfather's house and now they are using this space for this purpose and I absolutely love this look at this Mechalasa door so pretty so this entire space this entire house is filled with hand woven indigenous northeastern products if ever you get an opportunity to visit India do not forget to visit northeast because when you think of India guys the things that you see in the movies the Northeast is very different and the rest the mainland India Delhi Bangalore Mumbai they are very different as well so when you think of India Northeast is going to be very very different North is actually very traditional like say as the southeastern countries like Philippines and Thailand, something like that. So please, if you have a chance, check out Northeast India and don't forget to buy a hand woven piece like this. A pretty one, a beautiful one. Alright guys, I hope you had fun checking out the indigenous things of Assam, the Northeast, of Northeast and my house, my ancestral home. 